Having trouble with snake eyes? First things first, master the loop. Master the combat loop. This is what it looks like. You might notice something looks funny. It's because she treats the combat loop a bit different. Despite this, the rules still apply. Remember the rules that I covered in the beginner's guide. The combat loop is attacking until you get parried. Parry the counter, resume attacking. If they do a move during your turn and they don't stagger, it's a spam punish, so stop and defend. If they do a move that doesn't look like the combat loop during their turn, it's a special. Snake Eyes usually performs specials during her turn. So you parry her attack, attack until she parries you, then react to her special. This actually makes her rather predictable. Little warning about the map, stay away from the cliffs on the right hand side. Her army of simps is ready in that direction to snipe you in the name of their queen. Yes, that's the gun she's carrying, and if you try to be cheeky and play the range game, she's gonna shoot you. She has only one spam punish, a grab. So if you see the kanji, jump away. You see that after I jump, I rush back in so I can make sure it's my turn again. She can't deal damage if she's not attacking, and she can't attack if she's blocking me. During her turn, her specials include scooting backwards and shooting at you, or kicking you back then shooting at you. The easiest thing to do is close distance past her barrel. If you do that, her shot misses, and you get a free body shot. But the hitbox can be a bit tricky. You see them past her barrel, so I should be safe. But the hit still counts. I'm charmless in this footage, so I need the perfect parries or I take chip damage. But if this is your first run of Sekiro, don't worry. You don't unlock charmless until New Game Plus. If you're afraid that your hitbox isn't right, you can close the gap, then wait until the gun goes off, then attack. You see that I raise my block because I'm not sure if it will count. It doesn't, so I hit her. If you don't want to risk it, you can instead run behind her. If you don't have time, just block the bullet. No matter what you choose, you get an opening immediately after. Moments like these are great opportunities for combat arts, prosthetics, or healing. Ichimanji is a very good beginner combat art, simply for the fact that it drains your posture, and thus letting you stay aggressive in their face. What prosthetic you choose to use is dependent on you. But you know what? She looks cold. Let's warm her up. If you're on New Game Plus, you can use other things like the axe or the spear. Alright, let's put it together. <laughs> 